Well, good morning and welcome back. We're taking a look right now outside of our tower cam. Very quiet out there, partly cloudy skies, 67 degrees. Our dew points in those 60s. As we warm up this morning, currently though, those temperatures in the lower to mid 60s, as they rise, those dew points also anticipated to rise. So it could start to feel a little bit on the muggier side later this afternoon into this evening. Luckily, it will start to subside with the help of some rain. For right now though, conditions very mild and calm winds pushing out of the south between about five to 10 miles per hour. Those winds are going to start to strengthen later today, many of which also turning and coming from the west and the northwest. We're going to see them strengthen throughout the afternoon. That will actually start to help push the water um, a little bit more aggressively toward the shoreline, creating a high beach hazard all along our entire shoreline. So if you are headed out to the beach today, make sure to pay attention to those flags, those wave heights anywhere between about three to five feet today as well. And there is a rip current risk. Small craft advisory issued from noon today into tomorrow. So just again, pay attention if you are headed to the lake. Looking at our satellite and radar this morning, not a whole lot going on, just a little bit of some feedback. We are starting to watch this nice line of showers and thunderstorms make its way across the region. Luckily, it looks like all it could do is clip our northern counties, but it all it should do for the rest of our viewing area is just help increase some of that cloud cover. And we'll see that on future track that cloud cover really starting to move in chances for showers though start to pop later this evening anywhere in those late um, afternoon to early evening hours and they don't look very organized it does look like it will just be a bunch of very spotty showers these spotty showers could um, include a couple rumbles of thunder and a couple stronger wind gusts but overall just general thunderstorms to look forward to those will start to linger headed into Sunday as well so just keep the umbrella in the car just in case you'll only need it for maybe 15 minutes at a time these showers should should be passing through relatively quickly and then headed into Monday. Those showers should start to subside and it does look like we'll have mostly sunny skies headed into the beginning of next week. But for today, our high 85 degrees, partly cloudy out there and then those afternoon and evening thunderstorm and shower chances for tonight. 63 degrees is the low. We have those lingering showers overnight headed into Sunday and it will be on the muggier side tomorrow. Temperatures dip down with the help of that rain 77 degrees. We do have a couple morning showers that could be lingering, but they should start to clear by Monday 78 degrees. Look at the rest of next week's forecast temperatures, mainly in those lower to mid 80s, plenty of sunshine. It's looking like a beautiful, beautiful second week of September for you. Lots of us um, able to enjoy that warmer weather. Um, so if you don't head out at all this weekend, you have another crack at it by next weekend when those temperatures upswing on next Friday to 84 degrees. At least those nice temperatures are sticking around. Can't complain about that. Yes. Not, we're, thank goodness we're not in early fall. Yes, exactly. <laughs> well, it was enough.